Mom and Dad started the company in 1982. It was uh, the result of um, they needed a job. There was a merger between Frisco Railroad and, and Burlington Northern Railroad, and they were soon going to either cause them to have to move somewhere or do away with the LTL trucking side of that. And he saw this opportunity with terminal consolidation to create a Springfield hub. Um, so they started doing something kind of different for Dad, and that was taking piggybacks off the railroad. You know, the secret to success here is um, the people, but it's because the people care. I'd say the drivers are definitely the heart of the company. Um, without them, we wouldn't be much of a transportation company. Either if they're on the road, if they're in the office, they know that they're going to be taken care of. They know that they are respected. We care about people. And when you, when you care about somebody, you're going you're gonna to do what it takes to make it successful. We do everything that we can to make sure that Transland is a success and that the driver is a success. And you can do both. There, there's one thing that sums up Transland, and, and that's a family. Well, Glenn and Ann Walker, the founders of the company, are some of the best people ever. They talk to you, they, they get to know you and your family. I'm glad that uh, Glenn's been able to keep the doors open on this place because, you know, when you start out with two trucks and, uh, you know, a couple of drivers and then, you know, 30, 35 years later, <laughs> you've grown and some of the guys that started out are still here. You know, we had a guy celebrating 20 years just the other day with the company and um, people don't stick around bad companies for that long, not in the trucking industry. People don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. At that point, when people understand who you are and that you care about them, you can really work together. Everybody knows everybody by name. And I can't see any reason why you don't want to come here and stay. The night that I was in the hospital with my wife, she'd just gotten out of surgery a few hours before, and I'm just expecting a couple family members to be there. And But when a fleet manager actually shows up out of the blue and offers, you know, his condolences, his thoughts, his prayers, the gratitude is just unreal. I'm like, I'm actually somebody here. I'm, I'm with a company that has the respect that I deserve. And, you know, not for just me, it's for my wife too. They show they care. We have this, this family values uh, approach to doing things that a lot of people can talk about, but it's something that um, if you explore our social media pages and, and other things, you'll see that we live our values every day.